Hello, I'm Ridge Bowman with NASA's Office of Inspector General. Key to NASA's efforts to achieve its human exploration goals beyond low Earth orbit is development of the Space Launch System, or SLS. SLS is a two-stage heavy lift rocket that the agency intends to use to launch both crew on the Orion capsule and scientific payloads into space. In 2012, NASA contracted with a Boeing company to build two SLS core stages. The first stage of the rocket, consisting of fuel tanks and supporting infrastructure, and an exploration upper stage, or EUS, a new and more powerful second stage designed to increase the rocket's up mass capability. NASA had hoped to launch the first uncrewed mission of the combined SLS Orion system by December 2017 and the first crewed mission in mid-2021. However, those launch dates have slipped significantly due to production delays with the SLS's core stage. In this audit, we reviewed whether Boeing is meeting cost, schedule, and performance goals for the SLS core stage's contract, as well as NASA's oversight of the project. With $5.3 billion spent as of July 2018, NASA expects Boeing to exhaust the contract's current value by early 2019, nearly three years before the contract is supposed to end, without delivering a single core stage or the EUS. As a result, the SLS program will require a major increase in funding and renegotiation of the contract to complete two core stages and the EUS. Moreover, at its current rate, we project Boeing will spend at least $8.9 billion through 2021, double the amount initially planned, while delivery of the first core stage has slipped two and a half years. Our audit work determined that the cost increases and schedule delays can be traced largely to management, technical, and infrastructure issues driven by Boeing's poor performance. We also faulted NASA for several poor contract management practices we found contributed to SLS program cost and schedule overruns. For example, contrary to federal guidance, NASA lacks visibility into contract costs and is unable to determine the cost of a single core stage. We also found flaws in NASA's evaluation of Boeing's performance, resulting in overly generous award fees since 2012. Considering the SLS program's significant cost overages and schedule delays, we question nearly $64 million in award fees already provided to Boeing. We made seven recommendations to NASA in this audit designed to increase the sustainability, accountability, and transparency of its efforts to develop the SLS core stages and EUS. To read the OIG full report, please visit our website at oig.nasa.gov.